Hello again, Tom here from Wheeler Automotive. Today, showing you around a car I know very well, because this is my mum's Audi Q3. Um, it's a two litre TDI uh, Quattro, so it's the four wheel drive one. It has the S-Tronic gearbox, starts, stops and drives incredibly well, no faults with it whatsoever. Um, <clears throat> to prepare it for sale, we're going to have the uh, cam belt and water pump changed because that's due. We're going to give it uh, a service as well. Um, it's recently had new tyres all the way around. Um, yeah, cracking car. My mum only uh, wanted something smaller, so I've just bought her a lovely little mini convertible. Um, so this one is surplus to requirements. Uh, Got a fantastic service history with it, a lot of services at Audi and uh, some at independent garages. Um, but yeah, in fantastic condition for an 11 year old car. It's done just over 92,000 miles. Um, let's go around it and I'll show you uh, its condition. So up on this near side front corner, there is a scuff here, which uh, was like that when, um, when I bought it for my mum. So uh, I'm not sure how that's happened, but it's, it's pretty minor, so we've never bothered to do anything about it, to be honest. It does have auto headlights. Uh, both sides are crystal clear. A little stone chip down here at the bottom of the bumper there. The offside, the bumper's perfect. Another crystal clear light. The bonnet's in really good shape. No dents or scratches or anything on that. Got a couple of little stone chipping marks, very minor. Um, no chips or cracks on the windscreen. Round to the offside. Offside front wing is uh, perfect, no dents or scrapes or marks on that at all. Here's the first of these Goodyear Eagle F1 asymmetric tyres. These were very expensive and they've only done about 500 miles. Um, she doesn't do a lot of driving, my mum, to be honest. This uh, diamond cut wheel's in pretty good order. There's a bit of corrosion under the clear look, and that's happened on all of them, to be honest. No lip on the discs. Pads are nice and thick, look. Driver's door. That is a bug. There's a little stone chip on the wing mirror. But the driver's door's in really good shape. No uh, dents or scratches on that at all. And the same can be said for the near side rear door. Really good order. All the glass is lovely and clear. It does have the aluminium roof rails. That is a fly, which look really tidy. It's another fly. There's no, uh, no chips of the paint up there. Got another one of these lovely wheels with a nearly new Goodyear on it. This one again, a bit of uh, corrosion under the clear coat. It's a shame, it happens to all, no, no lip on those discs and pads are nice and thick as well. Yeah, all diamond cut wheels, that happens to eventually. It's, um, although they look great, um, they don't last as well as either painted or powder coated alloys, to be honest. Round to the rear, it does have a tow bar fitted. She's obviously never used that, it was on there uh, when we got it for her. Both the rear lights are crystal clear. No moisture in them or anything. The rear end's in pretty good shape. There's a couple of very minor little marks to the bumper where stuff's gone in and out of the boot. That is a seat cover which uh, will come with the car. Didn't come with a parcel shelf when we bought it. It does have a space saver spare wheel. Quite rare for a car to have a spare wheel these days. All nice and tidy. I don't think the car's ever been smoked in. Um, just checking out this uh, this rear quarter. No scrapes on this side at all, really. I didn't show you that corner either. None on this corner either. All nice and straight. This rear quarter. There is a very fine dent just here. I think you can see it probably which again, I think that was there when we got it. Someone's car door has just touched it here, look. 
otherwise rear quarter's in good shape. These rear discs, although there's some surface corrosion on them, that's just where they've been sat around here at my unit. Again, we've got a bit of corrosion under the clear coat here. This tyre. I think this, this one actually wasn't changed, but there's loads of life in it. So that's probably three or four mil from the wear indicator, so six or seven mil on the tyre. Loads of life in it. Near side rear door, excellent, no marks on that. Near side front door, we've got a couple of car park door dings it. There's one there, another one just here, another one there. That's it though, other than that, really tidy. Wing mirrors are all good. Again, all the glass on this near side's excellent. Do have a light scuff to this plastic trim. Again, if my memory serves me correctly, that was there when we bought it. This is another good year, and this one's nearly new. Distant pad, same as the other side. Got corrosion under the clear again. But uh, there's not really any curbing on any of the wheels. Um, I still think they look presentable. But yeah, externally, she's in good order. Inside's lovely as well, nice and clean. So we've got a half leather and Alcantara um, interior. These are actually S-line seats, although it is an SE spec. So these are the proper sports seats. Uh, the front seats are heated. All the door cards are nice and tidy. Again, we've got the Alcantara inserts. Rear door cards nice and clean, as are the seats in the back. I don't think my mum's had anyone in the back since so she's had it. Nice clean door card, nice clean seats. Backs of the front seats are nice and tidy. There's not been any little darlings in there kicking them. Driver's door card as well, nice and clean. Not really any signs of wear on the driver's seat. Steering wheel, leather multifunction. It does have flappy paddles. Let's start her up. <coughs> So it's just uh, just nudged over 92,000 miles and it starts first turn of the key, runs incredibly well, literally never had um, any problems with it. It does have the uh, screen, not all of them, or not many of them I should say, have, um, have this screen. Uh, it does have a sat nav, you see there's the map there, has Bluetooth for your phone, it will stream um, it will stream music via Bluetooth as well. Either side. Got radio, got a CD player. Um, dual zone climate control. I think I mentioned it's got the heated seats. Both of those get lovely and warm. Excellent S-Tronic automatic gearbox working perfectly. A couple of cup holders down there. Electronic handbrake. Yeah. We do have the multifunction leather steering wheel. These are stereo controls on the right this one on the left controls the screen in between the uh, the dials there but yeah everything in here works exactly as it should really nice and clean headlining's nice and tidy as well no rips or tears or marks on that let's get out we'll hear that lovely super reliable two litre tdi engine it does have daytime running lights as well as you can see that are on now we've started it but yeah, it's been a super reliable car for my mum and I'm sure it will be for the next owner. Our absolutely lovely Audi Q3 2.0 litre TDI.